Comfort will kill your dreams if you let it. No feeling, action or situation can hinder you from achieving your dreams as much as not even wanting to pursue it. A tough financial situation may make it harder to achieve your dreams. Losing a loved one may make it difficult for you to focus on your work. But if you are so comfortable that you do not even want to try reaching your dreams, you will never, ever achieve your goal. Comfort is the invisible, unexpected villain in this sense. When Martin Luther King was fighting for civil rights, do you think he was being comfortable? When Jesus criticized the Romans and their ways, do you think he was being comfortable? Let's broaden our views. In what times of history have we made the biggest improvements or fastest progressions? In times of need? In times where we were everything but comfort. Wars, famine, crisis. Most people in our day and age are busy living in their self-made comfortable prisons. They go to school or work, then they come home, eat food, do some basic tasks and then spend the rest of their day watching Netflix or playing video games. The second they are slightly bored, they open up their phone and access endless channels of instant gratifications. Reels, shorts, TikToks, pornography. If they don't feel like cooking food, they will just order food that will instantaneously be delivered to their door. They don't exercise. They don't believe in a god. That's just silly nonsense. They don't need religion. It's simply a way to control people. But you. You are not like them, are you? Surely, if you feel that this is relatable, you must now feel a sense of urgency to change. At least I hope so. In order to grow and break free from your self-made person, you need to stop being comfortable. Every great reward comes due to great work, and very rarely is that in a position from comfort. You need to stop consuming media that gives you instant gratification. You need to stop eating junk food that gives you instant gratification. You need to do hard tasks that will make you a respectable person. You need to go to the gym. You need to treat people with respect. You need to be able to say no to things. Realize your own worth and your time's worth. You need to challenge your mind. Challenge your worldview. Read books. Learn the pros and cons to the arguments of everything. Form your own mind, not the slave mind. If you will, break free from the so-called matrix. I suggest that you go through what a normal day looks like to you Find out which habits and things you do that are not helping you grow, leaving you comfortable and weak, and cut them out, or start working on changing them. Watching pornography may feel good for some minutes, but having a loving relationship with a girlfriend or a wife will feel good for years. Ordering and eating pizza may feel good for a few minutes, but having a strong, healthy body will feel good for years. Playing video games may feel good for a few hours, but creating and watching your business grow will feel good for years. Invest in your future self. He will thank you immensely for it. This has been Lori. If you found this video to be of quality, please like and subscribe and help a young content creator out.